Hi guys, welcome back to another video of mine. So in the previous video, you had actually unboxed with me the true products that I have purchased from Taiwan. So now, upon using them one week, I'm doing a review of these products, whether are they worth the hype and actually worth buying. So without any further ado, let's go! Okay, so here are the five items that I actually bought from True to actually try out this range that's suitable for my skin type which is actually combination skin where my t-zone are actually more oily compared to like the other parts of my face so first off i have with me here is this uh the cleanser the cleanser is actually one of their most popular products and it's like widely widely advertised after using this for about a week now right i feel that the cleanser is okay as in like it doesn't dry up your skin that's that's good because you know some cleanser you use after the aftermath is like you feel very tightness and very dry so apparently this um does not give me that kind of feeling which i think is a good point secondly it smells really good like i think it smells nice la. like floral florals very mild sense of floral smell so i thought it was okay and uh thirdly i don't think it's as exaggerated as what they actually advertise Maybe be probably because I only use for like a week, so I don't really like see much effect. But it does. Uh, I think it does works as a good cleanser lah for daily users because firstly it doesn't dry the skin, secondly it smells nice, and then thirdly, it really does leave your skin very soft lah. So I wouldn't. I wouldn't think that it's like very 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 like exaggerate like how they advertise it. But I thought it was like a decent cleanser. Okay, so I would um, I would repurchase it again uh, because I thought it was it was okay. So next off I have here with me, right, is actually their 24K Go mask, the bubble mask that I have mentioned, which is also another product that they actually widely, widely advertise. And this product, right, um I feel that uh because I use it like three times for this whole week, because they say use two to three times a week. So I use it actually three times, about two days I use one time. And um, I do feel this one, after you use the mask, I do feel that it's cleaner. I don't know is it like a psychological thing, but after I cleanse my face and then I use this like every two days once, right? Those days that I use this, I do feel that my face is cleaner. Like, I don't know, it's just a feeling like your face is like very clean, that kind. And uh, and it's not very hassle because it's only three minutes and the bubble foam very quickly. After that, right, I really do feel like my, my face is very clean now. Like on the days that I use use this product, so I thought it was okay. And um, next I have is the toner because after you do all this, you use the toner, which uh only this product you use like two to three times a week. The rest of the product I use it like daily and almost like twice a day. As long as I wash my face right, I will repeat like the steps again. So uh, after cleansing your face and masking your face, I will use the toner. So this is the toner that I got. They have actually, I think they have three different types of toners, which include these. This is uh, the whitening toner. There's another one is the royal jelly toner. And another one for sensitive skin, I think, is the green color one. So um, I chose this toner. And I think I really like this toner out of like the rest of the products. Okay, I, after this um sharing with you guys everything right i will let y'all know like which is like my favorite product so far so toner is one of them because this toner after you shake it right it will just like you know become like that and they say that the the powder is actually the balancing the balancing factor uh in this toner lah okay so after i use this toner right my face feel very clean because this toner give you like a very comfortable minty kind of feeling so it actually really like makes me feel like my face is like very clean and then it's minty so it's minty but it's not drying that's the thing about it it's minty but it doesn't cause like your face to be drying which is like i feel very comfortable after using this toner so after the toner right i will use the serum which is actually for pores minimize pores and blemishes so i mean like i don't really see what's the special effect of this serum la. I, I so far i didn't see like any much big difference after using this serum but I just thought that it's good to have this serum to like for pores so that it will not like enlarge further or like for blemishes as well. Although I don't really see like the effect now because I only use it for 7 days. But um, in the long run, I will still continue to use like these steps la, because I thought it was quite quite simple and then it's just 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So yeah. 
Okay, so the last product that I actually have with me, right, is the balancing cream, which is, which is also the moisturizer lah. So I think they have different type of moisturizer, like I think they have the balancing one, they have the dark spot one, they have the hydrating one. So I decided to go with the balancing one since my skin is more towards the combination skin and I wanted to help curb the oily situation of my skin like throughout the day. So this one, right, I just thought that Although it was not widely, widely advertised, right? But I thought it was really good because I really tried and it really helped control the oil on my face. No kidding. I use this like in the morning. If I shower and like use the steps and I use this in the morning, right? Most of the time during midday, I will already feel like my face like very oily. I need to like go and wash my face again. But apparently after using, using this for like a few times, right? I really do feel like my skin... Like during midday, my skin doesn't really like... Like, feel oily eh. Like, I feel normal. That's the thing about it. I don't feel oily. I don't feel cloggy. I don't feel like there's a need that I need to wash my face again. So, I thought this was really good. But it was actually one of their hidden gem, I think, because it was not really widely advertised compared to, like, these two products. So, yeah. So, after, like, using all these products for, like, a week, right, I would say, like, my best, best top favorite products, right, will actually be the toner and then followed by the moisturizer and then followed by the cleanser so like my top ranging product would be one two three i feel because i only use this like two to three times a week and although i do feel very very clean but i don't think that there's like a very exaggerated height that i will do la. i believe like there are other cleansers that actually does the same as well so yeah so i think like my top three products that i really really like is the toner the balancing cream and then lastly is the cleanser because i thought like the cleanser did a quite a decent job so yeah i mean like whether is it worth the hype or not it's um, i won't say that it's like really really worth the hype but if you are looking for like a decent uh, average range of like beauty products that doesn't cost like a big hole in your pocket you can actually try out these true products lah um, like I mentioned, these two, I think that they have advertised it like too exaggeratedly, which I don't feel that exaggerate yet, maybe because I had only used them for a week. But I really do feel like the other hidden gem is the toner as well as the, as well as this lah. Yeah, I really, really, really like, like these, these two products because I really feel like a difference after using them. Yeah. So that's all that I have in today's video, like how I feel after using this product for like a week. If you ask me whether will I purchase them again, yes, I will purchase them again because like I mentioned, my earlier routine, I feel that the products are actually pricier and I'm looking for a more like average range of product that will do just fine for my skin and also at the same time doesn't cost a hole in my pocket. Now that I have more expenses with little peanuts around, so I just thought that uh, these products are actually decent and they are actually worth like worth buying if you are looking for something average, not too expensive, not too cheap, and something trusty. I think that they are they are fine. Maybe you can try their other range. They have different sets of range, or you can actually purchase them like individually as well. But I just thought that getting them as a set is actually more worth it because regardless what product I buy, right. I will definitely need a cleanser, a serum, a toner, as well as a moisturizer. So these are the things that like you cannot run away from. One. That's why I just decided to just buy their package and it's slightly cheaper if you buy a package compared to like if you buy them individually. That's what I find. And um, they also do have like travel size one. So yeah, I just thought that it's not bad the product and I'll purchase them again. So I hope this review helped you out there ladies if you are looking something like me that is affordable and uh, on the average range doesn't doesn't cost a hole in your pocket then yes i think you can try them out and i heard from my colleague this is actually a very very high product like in the apac region so yeah so these are the products and these are my reviews and thoughts about using them after for about a week and i will see you guys in the next video bye